Hujambo na karibu ili ujifunze mbinu za msingi jinsi ya kutumia Adobe Photoshop CC na hii ni Adobe tafsiri. Kwenye mafunzo yetu ya leo tutajifunza jinsi ya kuleta more images kwa design kila image na layer yake ndani ya Photoshop CC. Kwenye hii video utajifunza jinsi ya kuongeza multiple images kwa composition that you're building kwa Photoshop CC like many things kwa Photoshop CC. Kuna more than one way ya kufanya hivi. Tutatumia place embedded method ambayo automatically inatengeneza new layer kwa kila added image. Ikikupatia flexibility to the size na position ya kila added image as you like. Tukitumia place embedded command kuongeza another image kwa hii composition, automatically Photoshop CC itatengeneza new layer ya added image juu ya layer yoyote iliyochaguliwa at the moment. Kwa hivyo, step ya kwanza ni kwenda kwa layers panel na uchague layer ya juu ambayo unataka new, new layer yako. Nitachagua background layer. Next, nenda kwa file menu. Na uchague place embedded. Ambayo inafungua finder yako au file explorer where you you will navigate kwa file unayotaka kuongeza. Alafu click place button upande wa kulia chini. The added photo appears ndani ya open image kwa document window yako. Hii picha hutokea kuwa kubwa kuliko open image lakini hauhitaji kuwa na wasiwasi about that. Automatically Photoshop CC scales picha iliyoongezwa chini so it fits kwa picha original. Kabla you complete the placement na uiweke mahali unataka kwa composition, to scale hii picha chini proportionately without rotating it, shikilia shift key unapodrag kutoka kona zote inward. Kama unataka your added photo ikuwe about the same size kama moja ya picha nyingine ndogo kwa composition, tumia moja ya picha hizo as a guide kukusaidia to size this one. Nitaondoa kidole changu kutoka kwa mouse au trackpad na ni release shift key. Nitashikilia shift key and come over kwa hii kona nyingine and drag inward hapo. Upata added photo just about the same size kama hii picha nyingine ndogo. Next, unataka position the added photo pahali unaitaka ikuwe kwa composition. Kufanya hivyo, click inside of the border and drag. Pink guides hizi zinaweza kuonekana zinaitwa smart guides. Kukusaidia tu align the added photo kwa elements zingine kwa composition. Ikiwa umefurahia na size na placement of your added photo, complete the placement kwa kuenda juu kwa options bar na clicking the big check mark hapo. And that's all there is to it. Kama baadaye you decide kwamba unataka to move the added photo, unaweza kufanya hivyo by selecting its layer. Kupata move tool kwa tools panel na dragging the added photo elsewhere kwa composition. Ama wacha tuseme unataka kubadilisha size ya added photo, unaweza kufanya hivyo pia. Na kufanya hivyo, utatumia free transform command ambayo tulijifunza kwa video ya mapema kwa hii tutorial. Kwa hivyo, wacha tuseme nilitaka that middle image kuwa different size. Ningehakikisha layer le yake iko selected kwa layers panel. Nitaenda juu kwa edit menu na kuchagua free transform. Shikilia shift key to constrain proportions and drag kutoka kona zote kubadilisha size ya hiyo picha. Alafu click check mark kwa options bar to commit hiyo change. Kuna jambo moja tu keep in mind. Unapotumia place embedded command na hiyo ni kwamba kuna some edits huwezi kufanya directly kwa resulting smart object ambayo command hii inatengeneza. Sasa kuna mengi ya kujifunza kuhusu smart objects. Lakini kwa sasa, let's just talk about what to do ikiwa utakuwa kwa hii situation. Wacha tuseme that I wanted to paint kwa added image. Nitahakikisha ni kona layer iko selected kwa layers panel and nitaenda juu kwa tools panel na nitachagua brush tool. Ninaposongea kwa picha and click to paint, napata hii message ikisema kwamba this object must be rasterized before proceeding. Hii inamaanisha if I click OK, I'll be converting added photo yangu photo layer yangu kwa regular pixel based layer. Na hiyo ni sawa tu. I click OK. Na hiyo ni simple solution ambayo inatutanirudisha to paint kwa my added photo. Sasa vile unajua how to add images kwa composition, have fun kutengeneza your own unique multi image designs kwa Photoshop CC. Na huo ndio mwisho wa mafunzo yetu kwa leo. Na kwa mafunzo zaidi, tembelea tovuti www.adobe.com na hadi wakati mwingine. Asante sana kwa kutazama. Kwaheri.